Hey, this is Craig with Ben Lucero. I'm uh, here for Industry Night every Tuesday. One Eye Jacks, Ben hosting. I just want to say, what's up, old man? It's an awesome thing you got going here. Yeah. Okay, Craig's modest. His band with Sarah is awesome. They are recording at Robert Lang Studios a brand new album. No, we even go to hear it. And then this beautiful lady here, this is Jen from the band Pyrex. And that beautiful lady there, that's Mike from the band Pyrex. This is how gay musicians act around each other. You're that April 20th. April 20th at the show box. Be there. Be there. <laughs> Industry Night's a great place to network. You got two early ends. Uh, you learn a whole lot, you get a good questions answered. I would definitely come out here. It's a good thing to go to. Participate. Who the hell are you? Scott McKinley, Seattle Music Photography, Sarah Management, Cabby Gold Records. Other for this evening, this is Mr. Tom Olson from Hot Rocks TV. He's going to be giving our presentation. Say hi to the friendly Is he filming this? <laughs> Presentation. This is our first industry night promo. I forgot to tell you we're doing this. Dear God. Rick Rapp is this building. That's a Rick Rapp. That, that long haired, ugly ass, hippie looking guy, that's fucking Rick Rapp. Uh, drummer for the Maiden Seattle band, the Odd Maiden tribute. And the ugliest motherfucker on the planet. Well, next to me. What band are you in? Which winner thinker? This is like your first industry night, is it, sir? No, it's not my first night. Awesome. <laughs> hey, that's cool, though. What was your name, bro? Brandon. Brandon. From South Seattle. I drove all my ass up here by myself. Fuck <laughs> off. Uh, Rick and Rick. But this Rick is cooler than that Rick. Because this Rick Sometimes. owns the Vortex re rehearsal studio. This Rick pretends to play drums in a band. He's going like to kill me off the video. This is a Mr. Polecat, famous Polecat. Everybody knows this guy. Anybody said anything good about this alive. Okay, so this is Tom. Tom owns One Eye Jack's Roadhouse. I wear a Hawaiian shirt. He wears a Hawaiian shirt. So tell us about your impressions on Industry Night. You like to do it in your bar. Uh, Industry Night's been awesome so far. A lot of people coming in, learning some different stuff every week. Uh, a lot uh, to do with promotions and uh, you know, what bands go through and what promoters go through and what venues go through. And, uh, I think everybody helping everybody else. Uh, helping everybody else out gives a better understanding from all, uh, from all aspects of the business. All right, we got Chris here. He's a guitar player for Headsmell. He's actually a regular visitor at Industry Night. Uh, you want to tell us your impressions on Industry Night? Oh, it's been fun. I've learned a lot. Um, I've got to meet a lot of nice people. I've got to throw my band. So come out and see Headsmell. Drink harder. How's it going? This is Chris's beautiful wife. He drags her with him every night. And she hasn't killed him yet, which is awesome. Here we've got Mark and Corinne. They've been to a lot of industry nights, some of our regular visitors. You guys, tell us what you think about industry night. Very informative. Is it all learning or is there some fun involved? There's great time. And, and pretty girls. There are pretty girls here. Okay, never mind. <laughs> We got Hot Rocks here tonight. Tom and I are pretty cool. They brought some uh, t shirts. Tonight we get to find out about all the cool things happening with Hot Rocks. We got Mr. Sean over here. He's one of the nobodies that nobody knows about, but actually is big face behind Hot Rocks. And by big face, I mean holy shit. Yeah, he's, he's the beard behind Hot Rocks. He's the famous psycho. About back to burial. Tell us about Industry Night and your impressions, sir. Industry Night, my impression, is probably the best fucking thing that's happened to the music scene, specifically in North End, in a long time. Because people actually come together and share ideas. Like, I got an idea for table toppers that I never even fucking thought of before the other week. With the He's talking about promo, not naked women on the tables, but that also is That a good also idea. would be very good, with t-shirts and everything, just have them dancing around on tables. Sushi in the Raw. At shows. We I have do done sushi in the raw. That's fucking delicious. Yeah. Now I want some fucking sushi. This fucking guy, dude. I want a sushi. Little oh, fucking Ben. Let's asshole. talk about little fucking Ben. This asshole. <laughs> <laughs> but no, Industry Night. If you haven't been to one yet, get your ass to it.